Big switch from Banish for Cost. Have a dream. What's up y'all, this is Big Switch from Banish for Cost here, and as y'all saw before, we are opening two packs of Dupo. So, let's get right into this. What are we looking for today? Nudge the camera real quick, there we go. What are we looking for today, you may be asking. We are looking for Galaxy Soldiers, and not that, not that. Ooh, an ogre! We're looking for Galaxy Soldiers, we're looking for the gadgets, as always. Uh, evenly would be cool, you know? Uh, pretty much whatever we can get our hands on that's playable in a machine-based deck. What the fuck?! Uh, evenly would be cool? Bruh! <laughs> My name is fucking Jeff, I tell you what. That's our second evenly freaking matched. I am... Good lord, let's see what's, what we got next. Is it that... I am kind of speechless. Uh, nothing. Okay, that's honestly fine. Up next. Oh, another genius. Definitely be taking that, thank ya. And that's about it. Okay. Double or nothing. Could go to Garnet Theory. Ooh, the Crowley. Okay, well, double or nothing. Maybe. It's a maybe. We'll see. Probably not, though. Uh, ooh, Dragos to Palea. That'll be good once we get our Super Polys. Uh, Skirty Dragon. Why not? And we got a rank 8. So that's something. We just need gadgets and galaxy. <laughs> Play set of genius. Come on, guys! Okay, it's getting to the point where I'm actually getting kind of nervous. We really need Platinum Gadget and we really need the other normal gadgets. Another Ogre! What the fuck is this? Fucking box, bro! God, this is all we're opening, so like, I really hope we get some better main decks. To another double or nothing, okay. Card of Demise, interesting. Uh, more generic Xyz, okay. Bring me the gadgets, co money. No? Jesus Christ, y'all. I have faith in these last two packs. We need one gold, two silver, and right here is our gadgets. Oh, Link Rebo. We got our second Galaxy Soldier, so that means we are finally live for Cyber Dragons. Uh, Link Haribo, maybe f good for dinos? I don't know. I'll think on it. Last pack. All we need is any gadget right there. 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 Hey! We got a play set of gold gadgets. No silvers, but we got the golds. I ain't even mad. Not bad, not bad, to be honest. Um... 
God damn, we got a haul this time. We got two ogre, fucking dumb. Um, one gold, one galaxy, two genius, one security, one Link Karibo. I don't know about this still. One Dragostopalia, it'll be good when we get super polys. Uh, one evenly matched, so that brings us up to two evenlies already, guys. Jesus, Lord have mercy. Deck profile. We've got 3A, 3B, 3C, very standard. Two Heavy Mech, Monster Reborn. Three Gold Gadget, because you know what it is. Uh, Xyz. We've got two of the Morphtronic Boys, two of the Ghost Ogre Boys, or girls. One Sphere Mode, because fuck Spiral! Three Union Hanger for the spells, three Limiter Removal, three Econ, two Fortnite Base, and one Double or Nothing, because I really couldn't go for two, because that's bad. For the traps, we have three Call of the Haunted, two Fiendish Chain, two Ring of Destruction, and a little bit of six Samurai Support. I'm hoping it works out well, but we're tacking in two Evenly Matched. Kind of a niche card. I don't know if many people are playing it these days, but I thought it was good. I'd never read it before. It's actually pretty good. For the extra deck, we have one Link Karibo, uh, reason being Lost World. Dinos have been doing some stuff lately, so yeah, fuck your Lost World. I want to target you. Uh, two Cliffort Genius. Uh, two Scurdy Dragon and two Backup Secretary. The reason we're not only running two, 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 and not like three, one, two, or whatever, is because these two together are a compulse, and that's free real estate. Came up, it actually, it just comes up in general quite often, actually. You'd be surprised. Uh, one Deco to Talker, uh, because, yep, it's Deco Talker. Uh, three ABC, two Utopia, one Double. Uh, why two of these? I, I don't, don't know. know. Fair enough. Gentlemen and ladies and everyone in between, we are off to Al's. Gonna get our local game on. Uh, what are we trying to do today? I'm gonna say X1 again. Uh, that's the goal. Uh, luck may not play in our favor, but we've got some little performance enhancers to, uh, help it along, I'd say. But first, we need the meats. We need the meats. I guess let me go with one pizza slider and that'll do it. 161 at the window, thank you. Thank you, ma'am. 161. There's 11 and two. I like your tattoos. Thank you. You're all set. Thank you so much. No you have a great one. Girl, everyone likes my tattoos. You ain't special. It is a sunny day in Oklahoma, I'll tell you what. But, we do have our pizza slider from Arby's. Give me my little driving review, which is now a, a staple in, in these videos. I'm doing the pizza slider today from Arby's. It is $1.61 after tax in my uh, zip code. Very excellent. It actually comes, as you can see there, with a uh, marinara sauce on it. It's got like a little Italian meat blend. Lovely, lovely meal. Always remember to eat a well balanced mm, breakfast so before a day of dueling. I love you, pizza. Blanket statement. Mm. Together we can show the world what we can do. You are next to me and I'm next to you. Push me on through until the battle's won. First ulti of the series. You ready, guys? Say something witty. Yeah. To start it all off, we went against Shadal Invoked. Uh, <clears throat> I played the worst Yu-Gi-Oh of my entire life. Uh, game one, I forgot to use Union Hanger's uh, Normal Summon Equip Effect twice. Threw away a Buster twice. Would have won that game twice. Uh, I, I got 2 would Then game two, I just bricked. There was nothing I could do. But yeah, really mad at myself for that bad Yu-Gi-Oh. But we live and live and let die. Combo deck, by the way. 
Alrighty, that was round two. Went up against Lost World Dino. 2 owed, but um, game two I did some very rude. He went full combo basically. I evenly him, and then I go genius pass. So he has a conductor on field, right? He swings. I only have B in grave, that's right. I have A and C in hand. I then, he passes turn, he has one card left in hand. A normal summon C, ask if he has any response. He flips it face down. I'm like, okay. Chain enemy controller. So I tribute it, I take his, then he has to resolve his effect by destroying a card in his hand. So he flips over his own conductor, so now the conductor's mine. <laughs> then I win Buster, conductor, and it was game. Yeah. Good game. Good Yuki's. Is that a spell card here? You can't attack me this turn. Subscribe. <laughs> Alrighty, so that round is over. We lost 2-0 to zombies. All bad. Yep. Bricked unplayable game one. Game two, he ended on baller rock, and I bricked to the point where I couldn't play around it. Didn't open spheres, or sphere mode. Didn't open evenly. Very bad Yu-Gi-Oh. It was just like, definitely need a lot more support in this deck for it to work right. But, it is what it is. X2. Oh my lord, that was round three, wasn't it? Man, that was a wild one. Went up against Salaman Great. Holy shit. Probably best use of the day. He ended on a, uh, on a, on an Avermax. I was like, okay. Basically shitted out a decode talker. Shitted out that decode talker. You know what I'm saying? Um... <laughs> in a buster and it was pointing to his reclusia because he was doing like a dante build it was, it was actually fire then i uh, had a b so it was 3500 or 3800 decode talker swung into abramax with the buster to suicide and then i swung into it with the decode he shuffled back to the b but um yeah then i um made another buster because i had so many resources at that point he activated Will, I activated Buster, and he scoped. After, this is all after I, I evenly matched him, by the way, so. Evenly has been winning the game, so I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> evenly, man. But, like, if you lose on purpose, I don't like, I don't, I don't want to win fair and square. Yeah. Okay, what do you have? What's up? Alright, so our, our fellow here, Right, has XZ, Pendulum, Synchro, Galaxy, he has Black Blackwing, and the old deck called of Infernity. This man is playing with like a museum collection right here. That's lit. It is lit. He's about to send me to the Shadow Realm. Nice knowing you, buddy. <laughs> we are so far into the game. Look how many discards there have been. Good lord. <laughs> So all of that has built up to this. Yeah. Declare. Activate limiter removal. Ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Activate limiter removal. <laughs> Twelve thousand. Good game, good sir. That was wild. You have a lovely day, you sweet handsome man. So evidently we got. Fifth place or sixth place. We got six bucks worth of store credit. So you know what that means? Two fists of the gadgets, boy. Let's get into this real quick. And yes, we are outside because the owls is now closed. It's a very long event today. We've got a green optimization, code talker, raster liger, and Archfiend's ascent. Absolutely nothing. What are we looking for, you ask? Silver gadget. What are we pulling right here? Gold gadget. God damn it! Six gold gadgets. Okay, well, that's our fourth gold gadget. Um, we got another starving venom for Super Poly. So why don't you play Red Gadget? Uh, Red Gadget is good, but I'm not gonna play it. And that's the end of that. Play Green Gadget. Fuck you.
I just realized I did not record a interlude bef after the last duel. So it was against Mystic Mine, Time Lords. Swung with a 12,000 attack. Wait, yeah, I did. Did I? I forget. Well, if I didn't, I swung with a 12,000 attack Buster Dragon, and it was game. Pretty cool. Discard like 20 times. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, all right, guys. X2. Not what we wanted, but we got sixth place. Not bad. Really excited for next week. Why, you may be asking? Our deck is changing a lot next week. So that's that's why I'm excited. It's because it's changing a lot. If you didn't get that. Yeah. Stay tuned. Yeah. But either way, I have been Big Switch from Banish for Cost. Y'all have been fucking amazing. Thank y'all so much for watching. And to end us off here, I'm going to show y'all the lovely uh, pre-sunset. So it's just a blindingly bright sun. Very reminiscent to the first sealed only duel. Thank y'all so much for watching. Peace the fuck out.